Okay, I'm here with Caleb, and we're going to do a little exercise that we got from the master class today. We're told for the master class to help for off the string. So we're going to be at the balance point for this exercise. You have to make sure that you're leaning towards the pinky. So you have a nice curved pinky. Do it the wrong way. Wrong way is leaning towards the first finger. Right way is this. Thumb is on its tip. And this is to help you feel, to get a better spiccato. Remembering that spiccato comes from on the string and it actually should feel like you're playing on the string for the most part. So we're gonna do, we're doing like a little scale up on G and E, or G and D in the string. That same thing like we just did, go. Oh. Don't let it jump out. Like, pu be pushing it in the string. Do it again. Ready? Go. Move your fingers. Your fingers should feel like you're going in a circle. Let's go faster. Two. Ready? Go. up bow like this. Okay, let's do it even faster. Here we go. We're staying in the string. We're not coming out. One, two, ready, go. Good. And Caleb, you could get your pinky a little more curved because it, one, one, you ready, play. out of the string at all yet one if anything when you get to the point where you're playing spiccato it should feel like it's jumping on its own and you're kind of trying to keep it in the string not you're trying to pull it out if you're trying if you're trying to pull it out then you're doing it wrong one two caleb mm -hmm. one two ready go <laughs> Said in the master class today was that 
sometimes it's not even coming out of the string and it just sounds like it is like it's not even coming out of the string okay we're gonna go even faster now here we go two one two ready go Watch me, you're moving a little too much. You ready? Just me. Do it again. One, two, ready. Oh, check your bow hand. This is called supination. This is called pronation. You need more supination to be able to play this. One, two, ready, go. Don't let it come out. Ready, go. Just one. Now with two strings, two. Ready, go. Now just one string coming out a little bit too. Let me first. Ready, go. Oops, I didn't get it. Two. Ready, go. You move a little more with this, a little flappier too. Feel like you're flapping back and forth, but you're just staying on one string. Two, ready, go. But now we're staying on one string. Two, one, two, ready, go. Okay, so you lost the floppiness. Now you're going. You guys can see him in the background. He's got his fingers really stiff. One, get your, uh, 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 uh. More, 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 more. Lower. You got to get this, your Mount Everest pinky down. I'm going to come back there and help him. There. There we go. So get your bow over to the G string, but not by doing this. By going this. Ready? One, two, ready, go. Okay, Caleb, you're going to go home and watch this video and see how my hand's moving like this and your hand's going like this. And then you're going to keep going through this exercise every day.